yeah, let's maybe um, demo a game, right? Can we like implement like a small game uh, on HTML? What game do you like the most? Uh, let's go old school, Snake. Oh, nice. Snake is a brilliant choice. <laughs> um, okay, um, let's try it out, shall we? Let's um, implement the Snake with HTML, JS, CSS. Maybe let's use uh, WASD to control the Snake. Uh, let's hit uh, Enter. All right, so wow, the model gives us a really long implementation of the Snake game. Uh, let's see how it goes. Can you describe to me what it's doing? Like... Um, so it basically thinks through like how we design the game, how to design the canvas, how to design the grid, and how to implement the different logic of this Snake game. Uh, let's copy the, copy the code. HTML and um, let's see what's your snake game. Okay, we have a snake game. It says press spacebar to start or restart. Use WASD to control. Okay, we have um, this little grain snake, and uh, it tries to eat this uh, red apple. I assume. <laughs> um, okay, let's make it more spicy. Harder. Yeah, let's make it harder. What are your what are the options in our in our mind? Can you put in some obstacles? Oh, that's a that's a brilliant choice, right? The snake should have some obstacles. Um, uh, do you have any design choice you want to make in the obstacles? Maybe make the obstacles the letters AI. Oh, <laughs> that's nice. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. Tell this model to um, add some obstacles and um, they should form the letter AI. Right, now the model is thinking and uh, it uh, returns us um, a new implementation that tries to further implement AI into uh, the grid. All right, and then after outputting the code, it also gives us some um, like uh, description of what are the changes or the enhancements, and uh, but let's see whether the code works. All right, now it actually looks like a giant AI on the screen, and uh, there are all the obstacles. So it's really cool, right? Very cool. Yeah. It's exciting. Yeah, it's a very exciting and smart model. And uh, as you see, that the model really tries to see or try to think about all the instructions I give to the model and tries to follow the instructions try, and try to uh, correct its own errors.